Night witch, night witch is coming, night witch is coming, night witch is coming. Hey Wicked Arby, Wicked here and welcome to a Clash Royale episode. Today guys, we're going to go through the Night Witch Draft Challenge that has just been released and let's have a look at it right now. Okay, so uh, you need 12 wins and you get the Night Witch like usual. Let's have a look at the Night Witch actually. And you can see 190 damage per second. It's a melee unit, but the bats are in the air. So the bat level is 9 and that's the stats there. Very fast speed. I feel like the bats is going to be a good meta later on. And uh, it targets ground, obviously, it's a melee unit. And let's go ahead and see the one-time reward. So the first win, at two wins, you get Arena 11 Gold Chest. And then you get 8,000 Gold at four wins. And at six wins, you get a Magical Chest. And then 25,000 Gold. That's what I'm gunning for, at least if I don't get the Night Witch. But I, hopefully I will. And at 12 wins, obviously, the best reward of all. The Legendary card, the Night Witch, that is finally has arrived. Let's jump into battle and see how we do with the Night Witch. You do get a free entry, which is awesome. So it's pretty much a free Night Witch that you can get. Alright, we got Dragon Stake here. Oh, we got the Night Witch in our hand as well. Alright. Let's start, let's start a Night Witch push down the back. Get rid of that mortar. Oh, I love how the Night Witch actually breaks up uh, like that. That's awesome to see. Um, all right, we're gonna we're gonna hold him up. Hopefully, let's see what the Night Witch does with the the prince. Oh, stabs him in the face. Liking the look at that. Now we got some some bats going on here. I don't really have too much of an answer for the uh, for the princess. So let's see if the bats... Oh, the bats nearly took her out. It was close, but no cigar. Let's see if we can um, splash damage both of those items there. I don't really have an answer to the uh, the miner right now. But maybe we can go ahead and put the goblin hunt there. In protection of the, of the mortar. There we go. I think, I, I think I'm doing okay. We just got to be more careful. He does have the Prince, so we just got to be careful. Alright, Prince is going down. Alright, let's put the guards there. The good thing about... Um, this is I'm just going to have to Fireball. That's probably the only thing I can do right now for against the Princess. Let's do that. Boom. 1337! Woohoo! I love that number. If anyone knows what 1337 really means to me, let me know in the comments below. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and put the skeletons on the miner. Oh, those skeletons did some work. Let's put um, Night Witch, guards. Wow, look at that! Look at the bats! The bats are coming down like, like fire. Right, we, we, we need some more Night Witch action here. Oh, come on, Night Witch. I just want to see what he looks like. Oh, look at that bat on the left-hand side. Oh, wow. Ooh, that was amazing. Oh, my goodness. Uh, that was a great game. Great, good game, Dragon State. That was a good game. From Brazil. Bruno, play hard. Woo, woo. Um, okay, he's got the arrows. I think I'd rather the Ice Wizard, to be honest. Oh, this is going to be... We're going to use Lightning because we can use... Three? Ah, oh, we, we can use the... I'd rather the Furnace. The Furnace is a pretty good value. And can counter the Barbarians coming out of the Barbarian Hut. Okay. Uh, so he has a Night Witch. So we're going to pay attention to what he does with the Night Witch. Since I don't have it, it seems. Unless... Uh, let's see. He's, got, he's definitely going to do a Rocket of some sort. Let's do this straight away. Uh, 
Okay, that was that was okay. That was good value. All right, he's got the the normal witch. Okay, okay. We'll see what's going down. We'll put the ice wizard just in case, because he, I know he's got arrows, so you can definitely. Oh, here comes. Oh no. All right, we both we got the night witch and the um the normal witch together. Let's see if the bowlers can get rid of that. Oh, I'm glad I got the princess on the other side. Let's get rid of that witch before he does too much damage. Um, all right, that was that was a good push. That was a good push. Good push with the double witch. The double witch action was really good with um, from Bruno there. Boom. All right, let's let's start working on this side because uh, that that side's uh, getting a little bit weak. All right, I'm waiting to see if he uh, puts up elixir pump here. So let's have a look at here. We got the dart golem, so let's utilize the dart golem a little bit. Gonna get rid of that. The range on that dart goblin against that, uh, that, that witch was amazing. Now it's gonna start shooting the tower, which is great to see. Alright. It's a melee unit, so it shouldn't do too, like, the princess should shut down, uh, the bats. And the bowler should also take care of the witch itself. Alright, so we've got a bit of a push here with the bowler and the princess here. Um, let's go ahead and lightning spell that that was that was a, I feel like that was a good move he does have the rocket we just have to remember he has the rocket let's get rid of that wizard yes we got it Whew. all right furnace is going down let's put the princess uh, let's put some princess pressure now okay we will lightning spell that in a second. We might even lightning spell this three here. Alright, he's used his rocket. Let's go ahead with a dart goblin um, fire. Some dart goblin action. Oh, he's... Alright, he's, uh, he's, he's doing some good attacking right now. So we've got to be careful. Let's put that there. He's got the rocket. Um, we've got the lightning, so let's keep utilizing the, the lightning here. Can we get rid of that left tower? Yes, we did! Woo! Whoa! That was so close. I think I had a good hand. I had the lightning spell. But he had a good use at the start with the double witch action there. That was pretty tough to uh, take down. Alright guys, we are going to open up all the rewards. Uh, this is the dev build, so... Uh, we're gonna go and collect the one-time gold chest right here. Woot woot. We got some ice spirit. We got some goblin gangs, elite barbarians, and the wizard. And now we're gonna get the eight thousand gold. Woo! Look at all that gold. Uh, now the magical chest. See what we get out of there. We're gonna do this really quick. Fire spirits. We got the arrows. We got the skeletons. We got the goblins. We got the archers. Wizard. Oh, we got the lightning spell that pretty much made me win against Bruno. And 25,000 gold. And the Night Witch to collect. Boom. First Night Witch in the... Well, on the dev build, uh, it's my second one. <laughs> but it'll be my first one in the real game. And you get a chest right at the end as well. Let's see. Is it possible to get two Night Witches? Is it possible, guys? Oh my goodness. Can we, can we get two Night Witches out of this? Wasn't to be, it was just an executioner. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Let me know in the comments below how many wins did you get? Did you get the Night Witch guys from this challenge? Really want to know. And let me know what possible combinations in decks that you would put the Night Witch in as well. Really interested to read all that. Uh, thanks to Diamond Wolf and Bruno Playhard. Uh, Bruno Playhard's big YouTuber in Brazil. Uh, over 2 million subscribers. Really a uh, pleasure to, um, to verse him in that battle. And make sure you smack that like button, subscribe to my channel for you. And remember guys, stay wicked.